okay so hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel and today we are going to see how we can easily download and install dev c++ in our pc or laptop so let's begin without wasting any time let's go to google chrome and let us open that after opening we just need to type dev cpp or dev c++ once we have opened the first website which is showing sourceforge.net okay so this is the official website of dev c++ we just need to open this website by clicking on that and once we have opened the website sourceforge.net we can see the first option which is download green color button which is displaying here this download button we just need to press this button and within a short time of 5 seconds 4 to 5 seconds it will start to download automatically we just don't know to do anything okay and the file size is around 48 to 50 mb which is not a pretty big file so it won't take too much long okay so it's showing around 20 or 21 seconds let's wait for that okay so it will download until it downloads what we can do or i can just fast forward this okay so let's fast fast forward Okay, so here it has downloaded and I've opened the file. So once you open it will ask for user account control. Just press on yes. And after pressing on yes, it will start to unpack the data. Okay. So when it when it starts to unpack the data, just let it do it. It won't take too much long. Now we have to select a language. And by default it is English and we will let it remain English. We are not going to touch anything. Now you have to read the agreement. After reading just to agree and proceed forward. And these are the list which are which files this is going to install in our PC. Like all the compilers, GCC compli uh, compiler icon files and languages and all that. It's going to just download. Let's not touch this. Proceed forward. Next. And this is the destination folder destination folder or where you wherever you want to download dev cpp so i'll not touch it let it install in uh, c only now pressing on install so it has begun so it won't take too much long so the step was simple just uh, we went to google we just typed uh, dev c++ and the first website which was which has opened uh, sourceforge.net and just click on that after entering you will see a green color button naming download press on that just click on that after clicking it will download the file after downloading just open the installer it will start and just yes yes next next and all these after that it will start installing the file it won't take too much just one or two minutes let's fast forward this also. Okay, so here it is finished. Just uh, if you want to run Dev C++ just now, you can tick on this. Otherwise, just you 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 can just untick it. But I'm going to run to just display you a, an example program. So I'm running Dev C++. Just finish. Press on finish. And now yes. So Dev C++ has opened. Here we can see the languages which we which you whichever you want to choose by default it's english original and let it remain at english only now these are fonts color icons which are available these uh, and all these changes you can make afterwards also by going at tools editor options and fonts or colors okay so we'll just move proceed next and okay so yes installation has done and we are good to go now we have opened fc plus plus let's go new and we have opened a new source file okay so just uh, let's write a simple program so we are going to write a simple program hello world okay so just uh, let's see how we can do that i use stream then hashtag include i use stream then writing using name space okay 
next main function after main function we just need to write c out hello world okay and we are returning to zero or nothing okay all clear so you can write a type whatever whatever name you want i am writing hello or something else hello no, say hello say hello oh it's return i have just done nothing return zero Yes, see, so now here you can see it has printed out the output. If you're not able to see, we can just go and go to fonts and make it a little bit larger. So now you must be able to see hello world here. Okay, so this is our output, and this is a sample program which we have run after downloading and installing successfully Dev C on our PC. And what is so one more question what is dev cpp it is basically an ide in which we are going to write programs in c and c++ both the languages so that's all for today thank you thank you and if you like the like this just like and subscribe okay so that's all.